Let's look at the ability to be compressed of the different states of matter. So starting with a solid. So this is a solid piece of wood and if I press down on it with all my force, I can't compress it. Solids are not able to be compressed. Next, a liquid. So with this syringe, I'm going to, first of all, I'm going to draw up some liquid in the syringe. So there's some water in that syringe, perfect for a water fight. And then if I balance it here and push down on the water, whoops, we've got a bit of a leak there. No, okay. If I put my thumb over the end, I can't squash the water. I'm getting quite a mark on my thumb, see? But um, it didn't work. So liquids are not compressible. Now, if I do the same with gas in the syringe, we can see that the syringe goes down and then when I let go of it, it goes up again. So we are squashing the gas, we are compressing it and then let go and the gas is still in there. I can also expand the gas, not quite as easily, but I can compress it and then I stop pushing down and it comes up again.